Welcome to Cadence Design Systems Fidelity Tutorial Tuesday, where we show you how to use our fully integrated environment Fidelity in short videos of a few minutes. Today we'll discuss how to configure PyCharm as a Python integrated development environment for Fidelity scripting. PyCharm is a lightweight but powerful source code editor which runs on desktops and is available for Windows, macOS and Linux. Our goal here is to configure the package to use Fidelity libraries leveraging intelligent code completion, streamlined debugging, code navigation, and command execution in the terminal. We start with both Fidelity and PyCharm successfully downloaded and installed in the machine. After launching the Python IDE, we can first configure the environment. All PyCharm settings are located under the customized All Settings menu. Go to Python Interpreter, Add Interpreter, Add a local interpreter and select System Interpreter. Browse to the Fidelity installation directory, select its Python 3 executable, and click OK. Still in the Python interpreter, open the drop down menu and click Show All. Right click the Python path and show Interpreter path. Here we want to add the path to the folder containing all Fidelity Python modules. Click the plus sign. Select the folder underscore Python inside the Fidelity installation directory and click OK and apply. We can test code auto completion by trying to import Fidelity modules into a Python script. Notice how the modules belonging to Fidelity are suggested while typing. One can also launch Fidelity directly from the terminal of PyCharm. That allows, for example, running scripts in the Fidelity interface and getting command line outputs in PyCharm. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, be sure to click the thumbs up button to subscribe to our channel for more upcoming content like this. If you have any questions or suggestions for future videos, please drop us a line down below and connect with us on LinkedIn, which is linked in the description. Thank you all and have a great Tuesday.